Do you know what K-pop is? Korean pop. Stay friends with people who are like-minded. The first look at a Muslim girl eating pork bacon. <laughs> if you're doing any business, you gotta make sure you understand taxes. Yes. Moist, melt in your mouth. I'm not saying you're wrong, but I'm right. You like to get shit and put a ring on it. You and Papa Rory, some Louis and Versace, hell yeah, I'm feeling that rain. You used to be my cup of tea, but now I drink champagne. So, where do we go when we die? I cannot do this any fucking more! I came to my buddy's cottage here, and, and there's a white girl singing in Korean. I don't know what she's saying, but she's dressed in a crazy onesie and she's singing Korean. There's a bug. Hey! The bug. It's a moth. It's a moth. It's a moth. Do you know what K pop is? Korean pop. Oh, K pop. That makes total sense. So how does the whole uh, Korean pop fall into place? I, music is just like one of my passions really. And I've always loved languages and like Asian stuff, I don't know why. But like when I discovered K-pop and it was music and languages and Asian stuff put together, I was like, there's a dance choreograph from start to end for pretty much every K-pop song. So in K-pop, like the performers don't just sing, they actually dance and sing, so I really, really like that. So what are some of the uh, the bigger, the better moves of uh, K-pop? Okay, we just want, we just want, we just want dumb. <laughs> K-pop dance is like, just in itself, other than the music, is like really inspiring, I don't know. Is it big in Canada? I would say K-pop is pretty international now. Yeah. Like there are, there's K-pop festivals, there's random K-pop dances in Toronto, like pop-up K-pop dances where you, you just like play random K-pop songs and you jump in if you like know K-pop moves. Very serene out here. So this is uh, this is my friend James's cottage. Now you guys may remember James from Unleash the Power, but he, I met him while filming the business entertainment show. Some will, some won't. Who cares? Someone else is waiting for you, whether it's a client, whether it's a date, a woman, a man, a friend. If someone doesn't like who you are, that's cool. And that's probably a good thing because it means you stand for something, look into doing some changing and again breaking these habits that have kept us stuck all our lives that our, our internal five-year-old is, is making us do even though we don't want to do something. And stay friends with people who are like-minded. Now, crazy shit happens all the time. I mean, crazy stuff happens all the time when you go places. So, uh, yeah, so we met this, uh, and I'm just gonna say it how it is. I met this white girl who sings Korean pop. It's so hot, so hot. She also has an online store and she's an influencer on Instagram. You and Papa Rory, some Louis and Versace, hell yeah, I'm feeling that rain. You used to be my cup of tea, but now I drink champagne. And I'm gonna ask her what got her into it. So you self taught yourself Korean? Nah, that's nah means yes. means yes. I agree. It means I agree. It doesn't necessarily mean yes. How do, you, how do you go about learning Korean though? Korean, I need Duolingo, talk to me in Korean. Seriously. Books. So. Crazy, crazy what kind of people you meet when you just say yes to opportunities because we were not actually not supposed to come out here. But I was like, it is one of the last weekends of the summer. So let's just come out and see what happens. Sun's coming out tomorrow. Tomorrow. I'm gonna make a little mixture, okay? Make sure what? Mix this one? Sure. We're gonna go on a boat later, maybe tubing. <laughs> so we are going to be on this edition of the Business Entertainment Show, teaching you how to stay healthy while building your wildest dreams, not while making your wildest dreams come true. Today we have baked uh, some healthy keto macaroons, some chocolate chip cookies. We got some chocolate bark here. 
Carob is a uh, chocolate alternative. If you don't want the caffeine, then you don't have to have it. How do you make this? This is just a powder with water? Mm. It's actually nice. I could see this being really nice on ice cream. Where's the pan? We're doing some banana pancakes. What's the nutritional value of these? There's no flour involved, just eggs and bananas. And we're gonna teach you how to stay healthy when you're grinding it out every day and sitting on your butt. First, grab some overripe bananas. You mash them up. Three eggs. You grab th why three eggs? The eggs are there to hold it. So that's why we're using eggs. Yeah. So we're using eggs because there is we don't want to use flour. Not because there is no flour. Jeez. It's okay, she's not a chef like myself. Hey, did I tell you that I had lunch with Chef Ramsay? I guess I froze, I mean... You froze? What else, what else do you want me to say? You haven't even fucking defrosted! We're gonna be using the vegan protein and greens. Get three nice spoons, and so now we're gonna mix this up here. And yes, these will hold. I was very surprised the first time that I had these served to me as well. All right, so this is sort of the consistency that you want. It would be much faster if we had a bigger pan. We got some organic virgin coconut oil. A little thick. It's not supposed to spread. You're supposed to make them small. Too big. Oh, terrible. So what are you doing? These are not scrambled eggs. What in the fuck are you doing? So Chef Marson says that these are a little too big and she's going to have a hard time flipping them. So who owns this place? This is Mr. James Elliott right here. Unleash your power. Entrepreneurs initially will work like no one will. So in the future they can live like no one can. His book is about to drop so I will put links in the description. And no, this is not a plug for Mr. James Elliott. This is Cooking with Marson. And this is my book. Check it out on thecompleteartistbook.com. Hello everyone, I'm Jason Seiler, and um, as many of you may know, that I've been working on a book called The Complete Artist. I've been working on it with Marcin McDowell. It's beyond what I was expecting. I mean, it's it's amazing. I'm really, 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 really happy with it. I got a couple of paragraphs in here as well. It says my accountant. If you're doing any business, you gotta make sure you understand taxes because taxes is what's going to propel you to the next level. People who have high paying jobs are almost the, the, the best candidates to go out and try their own thing because they can take advantage of the tax write off. <laughs> this is like terrible. What? It's disgusting! Hey, this is terrible. I cannot do this any fucking more! So, this is not representative of how I would cook. I can't do it anymore! And that is how you cook banana. Super high protein, super low carb, super low sugar, healthy alternative, 100% coconut oil, protein, crepes. So we will be serving you 100% virgin, coconut oil, <laughs> banana, crepes with egg. Now the first one was created by her, so it looks a little like an egg, but it... No, don't be swayed by the awful way this looks. Years spent at <laughs> Chef Ramsey's kitchen has taught me <laughs> presentation is of it's even more important than the food itself. Because if the patron doesn't want to eat your food, all is lost. It's not found fucking me, but it's not found them. Please, you be the first. Me? Yes, you. Remember, you're on camera, so if you don't like it, you have to pretend. <laughs> this is the internet. <laughs> Delicious. Do you need the pillow? If you're gonna, are you going to fall? She's going to fall. Moist. in your mouth. Delectable. Deluxe. Goodness. What? <laughs> so the second one on the pan looks much better. Mm -hmm. Get a raw reaction. Here. Raw reaction here. Not bad. Not bad. What would make them better? Mm. Pumpkin spice. Maybe some yeah, pumpkin spice for sure. Cinnamon and pumpkin Cinnamon, spice. Cinnamon, pumpkin spice, maybe a bit of uh, almond uh, flour or coconut flour. Make no, it we're trying to not have flour. Well, it's, it's just not eggs, flour. banana. 
Almond flour and it's not, it's a ground almonds, a ground coconut. Really? I thought it was really good. They're good. There's Dom, our favorite K-pop singer. Yes, that's what we're talking about. <laughs> okay, well, good morning, everybody. <laughs> so, in the next episode, this lady here will be doing banana cinnamon rolls with dates. Tune in next time for another episode of Cooking with Marson. Uh, a first look at a Muslim girl eating pork bacon. Yes, send this to my parents. They'll love that. What's your parents' email address? Yeah. <laughs> it's good. She's it's good? So what's it feel like to sin against your people? Actually.